gentlemen, firstly welcome all of you to India First Tech Startup 2022 Conclave and Awards. Our next keynote speaker is Shri Naveen Srinivas Konappa, CEO RGK Silicon Science Private Limited. We are honored and privileged to have you all among us. Finally, let me welcome him once again on the stage for presenting his keynote. The company deals with manufacturing of electrical machinery, succeeded in gaining popularity within a short span of time. So let's hear it from him. Ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome him with a big round of applause. I want all of you to clap for him. On to you. Ladies and gentlemen, good evening. My name is Naveen Srinivas Kondappa. I started this company about five years ago. And when I started this company, my main motive was to earn more money, like all of us. But later, after one year, I did fell in love with something else. And that was to do what every other consumer electronics brand in the whole world is not doing. So, it's to put power, sustainability, and durability in one thing that we consider as emotion in our everyday life. Televisions. We see 11 different brands of televisions in the entire expo hall today. And I am going to talk about the televisions today. So televisions are not personal devices for a person. But televisions are personal devices for entire family, right? But consumer durable industry has never considered it personally. So here we come up with considering this personally and bringing something that is so powerful that it is a combination of a mobile phone, a computer, and a television right in the walls of every Indian home, just like you and me, right? So I am here to introduce not the smart TVs, but the future of televisions. Now you might ask me a question. What the heaven in this world are future televisions, right? Future televisions are something that can be upgradable. Let's say, I would like to ask a couple of questions to make this session interactive. Sir, how about you? Can I ask you a question? So imagine you have bought a television in 2022, a 65 inches television in 2022. Will you be using this all features in your television in 2023? No, you will not be able to use it, right? But some of them, yeah, you can use many of them actually. But let's talk about three years from now, 2025. Will you be able to use all the features in future? You may, some of them. But think about 2027. It's very difficult, right? You will not be able to use all the features which have been prescribed by the brands. What if we could solve this problem? of being future. So we have started manufacturing upgradable televisions that can just not be used today, but can be used after five years, just like the day you bought it. Hardware replaceable televisions where you just need to change a chipset of your palm size can make your TV more durable rather than just being a small TV sitting at your home. And let's go ahead and understand the purposes of what we are actually trying to do with our future televisions. Till now, televisions have been used just for entertainment. Or maybe some of the televisions are being used just for, uh, you know, some kind of demonstration purpose. But we are changing the meaning of televisions by putting them into different fields. And any feature that I'm actually showing to you now, is a standalone device and there is no external attachments we would be adding to the television. This is one, I mean, this is so many solutions under one roof. 
Let's go ahead. Home entertainment, as you already know, right? Television is being used for home entertainment, and you know we have been using it for decades as of now. Apart from home entertainment, can any of you take a guess? What can we do with televisions? Any of you guys? How about you, sir? Let me show you. Gaming is one of the things. We have one, you know, famous game PUBG. I have a question for all the audience in the hall. Can you play PUBG in your television? It's very difficult. Hardware acceleration is too less. Controllability is not even possible. Imagine if we could make PUBG India being played in your television. Apart from that, online education and e-learning. 2020-21 has been a biggest milestone for entire education industry. People, kids have been in homes without having proper education. That's when we got this idea that why don't we actually bring something to homes of India where we could introduce online education right in their TV. Just by adding a camera to our television, which is already integrated in the package, you can have video conferencing, you can install Zoom and all other video conferencing applications and you can attend online classes. And apart from that, video conferencing is one which you can actually use these televisions for. In your uh, offices, you might be having multiple branches of offices, you need to have a face-to-face -face conversation with someone, but you know, laptop screens are too small for you, you don't want to connect a HDMI cable. You can actually use our Rydex Future TVs just without connecting any other external devices. Instead of investing lakhs together on it, in terms of thousand, you can actually achieve this particular thing. Business presentations. Yes, this is one of the biggest headache. Yesterday I have been, uh, you know, I noticed one of the person in the hall was trying to connect his TV with his uh, you know, his uh, laptop, but he needed a cable which was not found around. He was unable to present it for some time, but later on we found him some solution. So, uh, business presentations can be done without even connecting a single wire again. It is a standalone device. You can use TV by connecting just to the laptop. And the next one is long distance remote CCTV surveillance. Now, I would like to take, uh, you know, a chance to talk about my father here. He's sitting right here. So my dad, we are into rock mining. And in rock mining, there is a lot of monitoring which is required in terms of machineries, labors, and all other things. Can an owner sit in a place and start doing everything at, uh, you know, office itself? It's definitely not possible. He has to visit different places, meet different people, raise some funds, collect funds, too many things. How about when he is home, bringing home what his factory is without having an external cable. Screening the entire CCTV applications right into the big screen, 65 inches big screen in the home will bring the change. Any business owners who wants to monitor their industries, their offices and all can monitor from a long range distance. Stock market users. I've been facing a lot of difficulties with small screens like tablets and mobile phones. Now the trend has changed. We got 64 inquiries in just one month for stock market trading requirement for our televisions. We can make sure some of the famous applications like Zeroda and all to be installed right in our TV and we can tr start trading right from our TV. That's why I told, this is just not a television but it's a combination of a computer, a mobile phone and a television all together. The next one is development. Let's see, we have a proof here, this big screen. Imagine you need to, uh, you know, design an application for such a big screen. It's definitely not possible to simulate it with a tablet. It's a real life crisis. So, we have the capability in our television where you can actually deploy the Android and other kind of applications. Let's say you can also plug in Windows into it. Install apps in the Windows. You can actually plug in the Windows card and start designing application for large screens in Windows also. Android, you want to test your Android applications, just download, install the application and start trying it. You can also do ADB connect without even, you know, a cable via Wi-Fi. So that's one of the things. And digital signage, who doesn't like advertisement? Not the customers, 
business owners who doesn't want to do advertisements and now digital signage industry is been in trend in such a way that everybody wants to go in there and start advertising their products right for that digital signage industry has its own kind of uh, deficiencies as of now you need to have an external computer connected to your tv to make sure the application is running the stream is running without any kind of hassle and a lot of things and one of the other thing is tvs are being designed be horizontally till now but can you convert a horizontal tv into vertical just like you flip your phone yes ridex future tvs can do that and how about making a tv touch screen touch screen tvs are very expensive you want to buy a 43 inches touch screen tv that would take out 2 to 3 lakhs from your pocket imagine you can actually connect a infrared touch frame to your tv and make your entire tv a touch capable device just in thousands so this can give thank you so this can actually do a lot of things if you want to test large applications or if you want to have interactive displays in your malls and different uh, let's say your stores also you can have that done at a very economical price rather than just spending lakhs together on it augmented reality how many of you know lens card here can i have some of your hands up please lens card 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 13 people know lens card here i'm sure that more than that knows Uh, about lens card here imagine you want to buy a new glasses for yourself visiting to lens card is a tough job how about if you can actually simulate the same thing right at your home augmented reality can actually do it for us we have been talking about ar since morning no definition definition was given augmented reality is something that it's a virtual reality that can give you a feel of realistic things that you have been seen on the screen so we can actually use our devices for simulating augmented reality and all so these are some of the listed features which we have as of now but still we are exploring more and more and also we have tried and tested 93000 applications we have tested them to be working in our televisions there is no other television in the global level which can actually accommodate these many number of android based applications that could solve problems of millions of humans So that's it about Ridex. We have our booth set up right here. You can have an experience of Ridex Aria future TVs right here. We have our booth 88 and 90. Please come over there, experience the TV, give us your feedbacks, tell us your problems if we can actually solve some of those. We'd be happy to do that. Thank you very much.